I've, uh, I've told you about, before this, I told you about this evolutionary process in the cells that are splitting in the body and uh, what we could do about that and how to look at that and the swine flu. And then towards the end, I mentioned that in 2012 is going to be a dark time on the planet. People will wonder where the sun is. And uh, that has to do with the accumulation of all the dense karma that we are creating. I mentioned that um, those who are calling some white, some black, some, some democratic, some uh, republican, or whatever you call, or whatever people call one another when they're in anger and when they're in disgust, uh, that's going on in a big way today very, very big way, and that needs to cease. The more that keeps up, the darker this, this year is going to be. And that has to do with the physical darkness. But this has to do with energy. And I want to talk to you about that energy. Karma is a very, very powerful energy. And unwittingly, we have developed more and more karma that is negative and creating more and more harm on the planet. And we want to do something about that. So I have been given what I call a two-minute drill, which can change this, which can make the world a little happier, a little bit better, and more sunlight in 2011 as we prepare to go into that 2012 shift. So take a moment with me and let me explain to you how this meditation works, if you would. So sit up straight in a chair, that's your first thing you want to do, and realize that you are this human being who has power of your thought. You have power with your thought. Your thought is very powerful. You probably don't realize it, but everything you've done in the past was a result of your thinking. And today we're going to want to try to do something with that thinking. And in the background you're listening to this metronome beating and it's there for a purpose. So if you want to do this meditation you will do what I do and uh, I will go through the process, teach you how it works and then you can do this process and then it's highly recommended by the masters and teachers and Jesus to do this at exactly noon, wherever you are, whatever the part of the world you're in, do this exercise. It only takes just a couple of minutes. So you set your metronome, as I have, for 56 beats a minute. Why 56 beats a minute? Because that's the beat of the planet. The planet normally beats around 60 beats a minute. But we want to bring it down a little less than that because it's higher than 60 beats right now. It needs to come down just a little bit to smooth out the energies on the planet. In human beings and on the world and in the ocean and in the waves and the skies, we want that energy to be in a much better harmony, a much better beat. If we do that, then life will be happier and more successful for everyone. So sit straight, sit calm, sit very still, and I'll say this all out loud so you can hear it, but I'm going to be thinking that. And as I'm doing that, sitting here, getting myself squared away with my power and yours, because you'll be helping me, and you'll be helping all your friends and your family doing this, is to get yourself in a place where you have a feeling that you're part of the world and you're on the world. You can feel yourself on the world. And know that your thinking has something to do with it. And it has the power to change it. And collectively, if we all do this, we will change it. And so take the time, knowing that, to get in that place where you just feel absolutely comfortable. I'll put my stick down because I don't want anything in the way of my body being the instrument that conveys this power into the world 
to, to beat at 56 beats a minute. So I will join that beat. And how I join that beat is to feel peaceful, feel part of the world. How I feel that part myself, and you may choose other ways, is I start out by feeling like I'm floating, like I would float in a bathtub or in a small body of water or any place where I can float in water and get that sort of a floating light feeling. And then I want that slow light feeling get strong and I want to put it in the world. Now personally you can just put it into the water in the world or you might do what I like to do. I like to put it in a tree. I put it in a tree, become part of that tree, <clears throat> put it in the leaves, feel the breeze in the tree, and with that feeling in my body, I project that body by taking no thought absolutely none. I let no thought come to me. I just send this thought into the planet, all around the planet, all over the planet, for two minutes. I get that feeling focused in my heart, in the center of my body, closer to the stomach, the very center of me, the heart chakra. And I feel that heart chakra. I take no thought. And I let that beat go through me and into the earth. One. I just did that. It's not exactly 12 right now, but I did do it before at 12, and I recommend that everybody on earth do this for that two minutes and give that power, your power, to the earth, clean, no thought, just the knowing is going into the world to bring a harmony into the world. And I thank you for that. So it is. <laughs>